Assalamu alaikum students Today we start chapter number 1 number system introduction the first of all we start with the numbers in start we written the number like bars one for one line for one number two bar for two numbers three bar for three numbers and so on next around 5000 bc egyptian had a number system based on 10 and this symbol like intersection is for 10 and 9 or as a 100 was used by the by them and 324 was symbolized as if we write 324 in old symbols 300 and three symbols of 100 2 at the place of 10 2 sign of tens and 4 bars this is the old written symbols next the development of natural numbers whole numbers integers and rational numbers as you know 1 2 3 4 are natural numbers it is also based on decimal system the solution of the equation x plus 2 is equal to 2 leads us to the number 0 and this set is called whole number 0 to onward if we add 0 in a natural number this set is called whole number and sh- written show by all letter w then equation x plus 4 is equal to 2 if we solve this equation we reads a number negative number and this set is called integers in which 0 and positive and negative numbers next equation we face 2x is equal to 3 If we solve this equation, we get a number three over two, which introduces us the set rational numbers like a over b is a rational number, a and b are always integers, and the denominator of the of this number is never equal to zero. Next. irrational numbers the solution of the equation x square is equal to 2 if we solve this equation it becomes square root of 2 and square of 2 is a irrational numbers and then union of rational and irrational number is a real number also irrational numbers can are those numbers which cannot be written in the form of a over b or p over q where p and q are integers next decimal representation of rational and irrational numbers so first numbers like terminating decimal a decimal which has only a infinite number of digits in the decimal part is called a terminating decimal like 202.04 after some numbers and then mm, the number stop are example of terminating decimal since a terminating decimal can be converted into a common fraction we can easily it's convert into a fraction so every terminating decimal represent a rational number recurring decimal 
this is another type of rational numbers in general recurring or periodic decimal is a decimal in which one or more digit repeat indefinitely recurring decimal can be converted into a common fraction so every recurring decimal represented a rational number if we divide 1 divided by 3 we get a recurring decimal number a non terminating non recurring decimal is a decimal which neither terminate nor it is recurring it is not possible to convert such a decimal into common fraction thus non terminating non recurring decimal represent irrational number terminating wo decimal the jaise 0.5 0.03 0.234 डेसिमल के बाद कुछ नंबर आते हैं फिर रुक जाते हैं रिकरिंग में वो वाले डेसिमल नंबर्स हैं जैसे 0.333 आपको पता है नेक्स्ट 33 चलता रहेगा रिपीट हो रहे हैं या रुक जाते हैं उनको हम कहते हैं टर्मिनेटिंग एंड रिकरिंग तो जिनमें ये दोनों कंडीशन ना हो उनको कहते हैं नॉन टर्मिनेटिंग नॉन रिकरिंग तो वो आ जाते हैं आपके पास इरेशनल नंबर्स Next, these are the example of rational and irrational numbers. In first example, this is point two five. If we convert into decimal twenty five over hundred, rational number. 0.333 1 over 3 equal to 1 over 3 recurring decimal first example is terminating decimal second is recurring third is also a recurring fourth one 1 divided by 7 values are repeating <coughs> fifth one is non terminating non recurring is irrational number next is also a rational number Seventh also irrational number, not repeating number. So these are some examples. Pi is also a irrational number. Actually, pi is equal to circumference of any circle divided by length of its diameter. किसी भी circle के circumference को उसके diameter से divide करें. So number always same and this is pi. Proximate equal to 20 over 7 but not equal to 20 because after some digits their values are change. Next very important example is square root of a prime number also irrational number. properties of real numbers binary operation binary operation is we use between any two numbers addition or subtraction or any other condition is called binary operation addition law first is clear law of addition if any two numbers belongs to real number the sum is also belongs to real number ulta a jo hai represent karta hai for all ko koi se to real number aap le le unko aap add kare to bhi answer kya aayega aapke paas real number next is associative law of addition isme aapne teen number le lene hain aur ye isi condition ko apply karenge to dono sides ke answer same aayenge additive identity for all a belongs to r capital r shows real number ulta e jo hai ye likha hua there exist zero belongs to real number such that a plus zero or zero plus a is always equal to a additive inverse 
for every number a there exist minus a so that if you have a real number 2 then its additive inverse is minus 2 commutative law for addition a b belongs to a real number a plus b or b plus a both equation are same this is commutative law and these are the five addition law of real number then is multiplicative law same like addition same five laws clear law associative but the by integration is multiplication multiplicative identity is 1 because every number multiplied by 1 is equal to the same number and multiplicative inverse or inverse of 2 is 1 over 2 inverse of 3 is 1 over 3 and commutative law is like a into b is equal to b into a example is 3 into 2 is 6 2 into 3 is also 6 multiplication addition law like distributive property if we multiply with a bracket with a number a into b plus a it becomes ab plus ac and from left side and from right hand side next properties of equality and first property is reflexive property for all real numbers if you have a number real number 2 to 2 is equal to 2 2 is not equal to 3 jo unsa number lenge wo uske equal hoga wo kisi dusre ke equal nahi hoga symmetric property a is equal to b and b is equal to a transitive property a is equal to b b is equal to c and we can write a is equal to c additive property a is equal to b and you can add c to both side multiplicative property same like addition we multiply with c to both side cancellation property with respect to addition a plus c b plus c c both side are same we can cancel it cancellation property for multiplication a into c b is equal bc and we divide by c we get a is equal to b and c is not equal to 0 next is properties of inequality first is trichotomy property if you have two real numbers they they are either are same or one is greater and one is less just like 2 and 3 2 and 3 are not equal 2 is less than 3 transitive property if you have a three numbers or real numbers a b and c a belongs to b a less greater than b and b greater than c then we can write a greater than c like example 2 is greater than 1 and 1 is greater than 0 so we can write 2 is greater than 0 additive property a greater than b we can add c to both side there is no difference between the difference on the inequality sign multiplicative property there are two conditions if c is greater than 0 or c is less than 0 greater than 0 means positive number and less than 0 means negative number if we multiply by c greater than 0 agar c jo hai wo positive number hai c se aap multiply karenge to inequality pe effect nahi padega 
अगर नेगेटिव नंबर से मल्टीप्लाई करेंगे तो इनक्वालिटी पे इफेक्ट पड़ेगा उसका साइन चेंज हो जाएगा जैसे पार्ट टू में आप देखें ए ग्रेटर देन बी वी मल्टीप्लाई बाय सी तो देन ए ग्रेटर देन बी बिकॉम्स ए सी लेस देन बी सी एंड सेम इन कंडीशन सी ए बी सी एंड डी बिलोंग्स टू और इफ ए इज ग्रेटर देन बी सी ग्रेटर देन डी ग्रेटर साइड मल्टीप्लाई बाय ग्रेटर साइड एंड लेस साइड मल्टीप्लाई बाय लेस साइड नो इफेक्ट ऑन द साइन ऑफ इनक्वालिटी नेक्स्ट हम इंपॉर्टेंट नोट All above axioms, if hold in a set, and this set is called a field. If all the five properties clear law, associative, identity, inverse, and commutative hold in a set is called a group, and all the eleven properties above we discuss is called a field. मल्टीपल प्रॉपर्टी ऑफ इनक्वालिटी आर इंक्लूड दैट इफ बोथ द साइड्स ऑफ इनक्वालिटी आर मल्टीप्लाई बाई पॉजिटिव नंबर इट्स डायरेक्शन डज नॉट चेंज बट इफ वी मल्टीप्लाई बाई नेगेटिव नंबर इट्स डायरेक्शन रिवर्स ए एंड माइनस ए आर एडिटिव इनवर्स ऑफ ईच अदर एंड फोर्थ वन इज द लेफ्ट हैंड नंबर ऑफ द अब क्वेश्चन शुड बी read as negative of negative a and not minus of minus a we read it as negative of negative a and a and 1 over a are multiple inverse of each other next example number 4 that for any real numbers a b a dot 0 is equal to 0 to so, 0 can be written as 1 plus minus 1 and if we apply a distributive property a into 1 a into 1 a minus a also written as a plus minus a this is a called inverse property a plus minus a is equal to 0 very easy second is ab is equal to 0 we multiply both side by 1 over a 1 over a into a or getting each other because they are inverse multiplied inverse of each other is equal to 1 so it becomes b is equal to 0 thus a and b product of a and b is equal to 0 if a is not equal to 0 and b is equal to 0 similarly it can be shows if a b product of ab is 0 then either one of the number is 0 or both assignment for you question number 2 of x is 1.1 इसमें आपने नाम लिखने हैं प्रॉपर्टीज के जो भी आपने एडिशन लॉ में पढ़ी हैं यानी कि जैसे फर्स्ट ये क्वेश्चन है इसका तो ये फोर प्लस नाइन इज इक्वल टू नाइन प्लस फोर इज कॉल्ड कमोडिटी प्रॉपर्टी ऑफ एडिशन तो डू दिस असाइनमेंट 